Hey there, I'm Don Mello and I'm the Customer Service Manager for CraftCuts.com. I also manage our hand painting department and I wanted to give you a tutorial on how to paint a camouflage pattern on wood letters. We can paint your letters for you, but if you want to paint your own, here's how to do it. I'm using a 6 inch letter in the font named Gaudi Heavy Face Condensed, cut from our Baltic Birch Wood, but you can order any size or any font. The materials we use are acrylic craft paint in Trail Tan, Leaf Green, Hunter Green, Spice Brown, Liquitex Gloss Medium and Varnish, a 3 quarter inch flat brush, a round brush, 220 grit sandpaper. I also have a paper towel, paper plate, and water handy as well. I've laid down some butcher paper to protect my table from paint. First I'm going to paint the letter the base color in Trail Tan. Each painter who works here has a different brush preference, but I like using the bristle brush because it paints the letters nice and smooth. Once I have a good coat on the sides, I sand off the paint buildup on the face of the letter. Now I'm going to paint the face of the letter, brushing it on in the same direction as the wood grain. I don't need a lot of paint on my brush because I don't want it to drip onto the sides of the letter. Now that my base coat is dry, it's time to paint the camo design. I'm going to start painting some irregular shapes in leaf green using the round brush. This is a very loose design. Just make sure there's about equal amounts of each color. Next, I take the hunter green and nestle it around some of the leaf green spots. Lastly, finish with some spice brown. Leave some of the tan spots as part of the design. To finish the paint job, I brush on the varnish with a large flat brush. It helps seal the paint and gives it a fresh glossy look. Once the gloss varnish has dried, I will go back and touch up the sides of the letters as needed. Be careful not to get any paint on the face of the letter, but if you do, simply wipe it off with a damp paper towel. Camo comes in many colors, and this design can be used to bake darling pink camo letters as well. Painting a camo pattern is just about painting globby shapes using even amounts of color. Good luck with your project, and if you have any questions or just want us to paint the letters for you, we'll be happy to help. I'm Don Mello for CraftCuts.com and thanks for watching.